Hello everyone, Assalamu alaikum. Here we'll take a look how to get certain users from Firebase database using this ID. So we'll see how to make the query using ID. Now here is my controller and inside this I have this Google sign-in object. Since we are using Firebase, so I'm going to get a Google sign-in object. Now this object, Google sign-in, would actually have user's information. How it gets user information? For example, from that, from Google sign-in, we can just call sign in function and if it is not null it will return a lot of the things so as you can see the user property we can use display email anyway so here from this object we are getting user.id so which refers to this id so this is the id it refers to and then over here actually we are going to do a query how to do that now here we are referring to a collection which is called users now this is our collection as you can see now after that we have used with converter function now about with converter i have another tutorial you can take a look now you may not need this always you may skip that but here because we are referring to a collection reference so that's why we are not using any kind of documents so you might use documents in that case this section would be most probably with documents and the documents name or id but the most important part that i'm talking about is here so as you can see here I have this where clause now inside this where I'm referring to a field which is called ID now, this field actually refers to this one over here and then inside this I'm trying to do a comparison equal comparison so this is the ID which we saved early from Google signing object for the user so if it can match this ID or the other way to say Using this close statement over here it will look for a user that has this ID if it can find it will return the user but of course it will return the user in a special format which we call documents okay it doesn't really matter for now so what happens here we do a query on collection and at the end inside the statement we have this where section and we look for a certain field and we mention a certain field and inside the field we see what we want to match so over here we want to match an id if we have that id could be found in this users collection then we'll just return that now of course the returned object if it is empty so here we check if it is empty then you could do more fancy stuff like if you have a model based on that model you create a data object and then you add it to the database like this using this add function anyway so if you learn something don't forget to subscribe and smash that like button thank you